Joining me now is the French politician Nathalie Goulet. She's a member of the Senate of France and she's also a member of the Commission of Foreign Affairs and Defence Forces. Welcome to you. Now, the government is calling this incident a terrorist attack. How can officials be so sure this is one? Well, first of all, um, uh, the terrorist claim that he was acting in the name of um, so-called um, ISIL, Islamic State. And um, then uh, probably he has some comment when he entered the supermarket, so such as uh, al Akbar or something like that, uh, from what has been reported. So, and then uh, the file has been sent uh, directly to the DA in charge of terrorism cases. So I think that, uh, uh, yes, it is. And what was your reaction, uh, Ms. Gulay, when you heard about this incident? You know, it's exactly the kind of uh, incident, as you say, let's say terrorist attack, let's say incident, um, which is absolutely not predictable. You cannot imagine that one guy probably uh, alone uh, in the little town in south of France will act and behave like that. So but nobody can predict it. What is security like in France? Because, as I mentioned, since 2015, France has witnessed a whole series of uh, attacks, terrorist attacks. Well, we, we increased tremendously the security forces and also the tools uh, I heard your previous uh, previous uh, comment about the state of emergency, which now bring is bring is broke uh, into um, regular uh, law. So the police uh, has a lot of tools. Uh, we also increase the budget, uh, and uh, also um, we also increase the intelligence services. So uh, we did a lot of progress, of course, since uh, Charlie and the Bataclan. Uh, I think that um, even the um, speed in which the police uh, came to the place, to the supermarket, is also the sign that everything was ready in case of, which was not exactly like that previously. Now, as we mentioned that the state of emergency was lifted in October last year, was that a move that was supported by you? Oh, yeah. In fact, what happened is that we, we move the measure uh, which were in the state of emergency regulation into the regular regulation. In fact, it's just, before, before, it's just the same thing. It, it's, it's just that we, let's say, secularize um, the state of emergency as a regular regulation instead of an emergency regulation. But what you have to understand is that the tools are exactly the same. And we do not call it state of emergency anymore because all the package which was in the state of emergency regulation is now in the regular regulation. Right, so you're saying the country I'm is still on high alert. Nathalie Goulet, a, a member Everybody of the Senate of France, also a member of the Commission Everybody for Foreign YouTube. Affairs. I beg your pardon. I, I beg your pardon. Do go ahead. Yeah, I say everybody is on a high level of, uh, of uh, terrorism attack, of, uh, potential terrorism attack. Germany, France, Italy, you know, uh, that's, that's the way it is. We have to live with that. It's not only France, it's everybody which is under the threat, unfortunately. Yes, Nathalie Goulet, uh, in Paris, thank you very much for talking to DW. You are a member of the Senate as well as a member of the Commission for Foreign Affairs and Defence Forces. Thank you very much.